Hi, I'm Carly from Hoselink, and today I'm going to explain how to install a Hoselink retractable garden hose reel onto timber. First, choose the wall or surface you want to mount the reel onto. Then using a stud finder, find the framing stud. You will need to drill through the stud when attaching the bracket. Now, measure how high you would like the reel to sit. We recommend mounting it 34 inches, measuring from the ground to the bottom of the wall bracket. You'll need to line up the bracket so two of the drill holes, one top and one bottom, go into the stud for extra stability. Hold the bracket in place. Ensure it is level. Then mark the four holes with a pen. Use a piece of colored tape to mark out two and a quarter inches on your 3 16 inch wood drill bit. This will help you drill the hole to the right depth. Drill the four holes up to the tape marker. Add a washer to each of your screws. Set the bracket in place, then secure the screws into each of the holes using a Phillips head screwdriver. Use a socket wrench to tighten. You also need an extension bar to reach the two bottom screws. Once you have finished installing the bracket, you can lift the reel and slot it into the bracket hole. Make sure you've attached the faucet connector to the faucet. To connect the leader hose to the faucet, Line up the lugs on the pre-attached hose end connector with the faucet connector and twist together. You will feel them click into place. Screw the accessory connector with swivel into the end of the spray nozzle. This fitting should already be attached to the end of your hose when you take it out of the box. If it isn't, simply line up the lugs between the accessory connector with swivel and the hose connector with flow control and twist to connect. Make sure the flow control lever is switched to the open position. Now you're all set and ready to go. 